Hey everyone, this is Bo from the Mario server. I'm here to do a video on the Light and Darkness event. And this event came out quite a while ago, but I haven't done a video on it. So here it is. The event is super, super easy. Let's get started, guys. If you guys go over to the Mabinogi website, you will see the event page and, you know, pretty much what you gotta do for it. It's very simple, guys. All you gotta do is register your main character at the follower of Twilight in Dunbarton. This guy is gonna be like, alright, here you go, you get a pair of starter wings. And with the starter wings, you're gonna have to do a daily quest, which requires you to finish a shadow mission. Any shadow mission, really. And once you finish a shadow mission, there will be radiant shades that drop at the end chest. You will need to pick it up. And once you do that, you need to get at least five uh, for you know every stage. Turn it into the guy and you'll get a robe like that one right there, and you'll get another robe for your next stage, and then your last stage will be this robe. So it's, it's kind of nice, it's uh, literally just only 15 days of doing this event, so you have plenty of time to do this event. He'll also have you upgrade your wings, and if you choose all light rewards, you'll get this color wing right here, the blue one, for the light rewards. For the darkness rewards, you'll get the purple wings right here, the wing of darkness. And if you do a mixture of both light and darkness, he will reward you the wings of twilight, which is uh, the yellow wings. So in the end, you guys will get a pair of wings, but unfortunately those wings expire. Ah, yeah, I know. You'll also get some twilight coins during this event, and uh, unfortunately uh, the shop is not available until much later, so you gotta have to wait. Um, but you can get a Twilight Box which will give you some Twilight Box rewards or you can turn in your coins for these rewards here. Um, there are some interesting rewards like the uh, Extension Wing Coupons that will extend it to a year. I don't know if it's worth getting because if you guys uh, get the Twilight Box you have a chance of getting permanent wing coupons for your wings. So yeah, I, I kind of think permanent is good, yeah. Um, but probably is going to be a rare, rare, rare drop. Alright, um, there's also other things you guys can possibly get from the Twilight Boxes. Unfortunately, I can't show you this because I uh, don't have access to the Twilight Box um, or shop yet until after 15 days. But anyways, here is where you get started. Talk to the guy right here in Dunbarton. He's kind of shady looking guy with the black rope. <laughs> Talk to him and you're going to have to choose your main character. Uh, so he's gonna be like, blah blah blah, you sure you wanna do this? This, this is gonna be an awesome event. And you'll be like, alright, yeah, I choose me. Choose me again. <laughs> Confirm it's me. <laughs> you can't really do this on your alt in your account, so make sure you choose the right character. He's gonna give you a pair of these starter wings, um, and they do expire, so they're not forever, but you know, you can make it forever. <laughs> So they look like this at first. Nice pair of wings. They don't look too shabby actually. Very nice, glowy, and yeah, pretty. Um, so here is what you're going to have to do to upgrade your wings. Alright, do your shadow mission. Any shadow mission, doesn't matter. Shortest is better. <laughs> at the end chest, you're going to get a radiant shade. Complete your quest, your daily quest. Don't forget to do that. Uh, and also, once you've collected five, you will complete the other quest. And you can now turn in five of them to uh, your shady looking dude guy person, this guy right here. <laughs> so once you have five of those shades, which is basically five days worth of doing this um, event, yeah, you can't really spam shadow missions and get five in one day. You can only get one a day, guys. Turn it in, choose which uh, light or darkness option you want. Uh, remember, depending on what option you choose will determine your final outcome color of your wings. He's also going to give you a robe for each stage, so here is the first stage right here. I'm just turning in my wings. He gives me a nice pair of robes. Or one robe, actually. Alright, let's wear this robe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh, inventory. Alright, so now the wings, you guys can see that it looks kind of different from the, the first stage. It looks a little bit more fiery. So that's kind of neat. Um, you also will get a robe on your first stage. Let's take a look at the robe. Alright. Ta-da! Oh my god. It's cute. It's got teddy bears on it. <laughs> so that is um, the, uh, the robe you get on your first stage. The second stage you get uh, another robe. 
different robe, um, and again, your wings will be slightly different looking. You won't see the change in colors yet, even though you choose a different option. I know it's confusing, um, but once you finish all uh, three stages, you will get the final outcome of your wings. Uh, so, if you, like I said, if you guys all want light options, choose all light for the um, uh, for the blue wings. If you want all dark options, choose all dark for the purple, and if you want the yellow wings, do a mixture of both light and dark. Alright, so the, that is basically of it, the event. Super easy, right, guys? Anyways, thanks you guys for watching my video. Hopefully this video was helpful. Sorry I can't show you guys the shop. It's not out yet. <laughs> but I got a way just like you guys. Plenty of time to do, to do this event, so get started, guys. See you laters, and like always, stay awesome.